not good. Like, we were joking that Veronica died, and then she died, and I was like, I'm not, I, I don't like this. Yeah, I felt kind of weird about it in the sense that it was like, I feel like this is slightly more interesting storytelling than they've done in some of the stuff so far. Yeah. But then also it kind of felt a little bit cheese, like cheap. Yeah. Like, oh, here, nothing's made you feel anything for a while, and so we'll kill one of the main characters. The one you like the least, though, so don't worry. <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> hey everyone, <laughs> we're back hey. by the way. <laughs> I'm keeping Welcome that in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, do, do, do. Um, uh, so it's you go. <laughs> it's been a little while. It's been so fucking long since we played this game. We've been sick. It's not our fault. Uh, we've been really sick, and then we've had we've had to be away for family things. And right now, we're actually playing. Remote I'm not. Alone. I'm not in the room with Izzy right now. No. Izzy is controlling the game, and I am in my house on the other side of town. So if our voice and levels are not at the usual standard, that's why. So yeah, just we're sorry. bear that in mind. We apologise. Um, we apologise. I forgot what we're doing. I know that there's something to do with this old we dude. We literally oh. just no, no, no. looked at what we were doing. I know, but... Some guy has got to tell us about this, whether he can I find the bird. This way, this way. Remember, it was blocked off last time. Now it's open. Wow, good memory. Mm. Good morning, Nudel. <laughs> oh, the Benedict has passed through here this morning on his way to the top of the mountain. He said you were to join him there and that I should allow you to pass. I know not what he wishes to tell you, but please go to him with my blessing. It's funny how in so many video games, it's like there'll be like one guy and he'll be like, nah, I'm not fucking letting you pass. And you're like, what are you going to do? Are you going to fight me? Like, I could just push you over. You know? Mm. And we just we just take it for granted that it's... So yeah, so is is streaming this right now on Discord and I'm watching her play. And we're hoping that there won't be too much lag and... Um, Everything will be fine, right? Yeah, I was just wanting the um, menu. Hmm. Oh, that's right, we've got Eric back. Have we given Eric his points? I just want to turn the um, music down a tad. At least one. There we go. I think you just put it back to exactly where it was. I thought it was on four. I thought it was on three, but I could be okay. wrong. Should we just check that we've given Eric and Serena their points, just in case there could be fights? Yes. In the stretch, they probably won't be, but. Serena, no, but. Serena, look. no. Okay. So we had her, remember, we had her under. We spears. had her as a healer. <laughs> we had her and under spears. spears, that's right. She was clonking. She was clonking her life away. <laughs> that's kind of sad and ironic now because what's your face did, did clonk she's her life away? She's got all the stuff at the top. Yes, Harper she's Strina. got all the. She had Harper Street before. But she's got the whips, which she didn't have access to before. Heavy wands. Wands. Vim. I think she had Vim, though. Spooky Aura. Cool. Mm. I just like the name of it. <laughs> really, it's just I like the name of it. Okay, so. What do we want? Do we want more spears? Um, whatever spear stuff that we can get, that's good. That's reasonably cheap. Yeah, do it. I like that it hasn't reset us to zero with her. That skill I don't feel like we'll ever use, so I'm kind of like, eh, yeah. whatever. So we're up here. Harper Street. I kind of want to put something to Harper Street. Magical mending. Yep. I want to do that. Oh, well, what, we don't really need our... Sorry. Down, down to your... Uh, right? What are those skills in there? Heavy damage wand. to demons and beguiles them into the bargain. So we'd have to have a good. wand on though. Oh, it's like a smack? Okay. Mm, well, some of the. So uh, I believe if it's a wand ability, you have to have a wand on. Quite. I mean, that makes 100% sense. What's the. an upper bit? That kind of square over there to the top. Yeah, what's those things? Heavy, Heavy wands. wands. So, so we don't usually have a wand on for her at all, right? No, we have we spear. have a spear. So I think we, we need to go with Vim. 
Yeah. Harpistry. Vermin harpistry. Otherwise, it, like, it kind of doesn't make... Well, we have to change your yeah, weapon, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, oh. um, so in that case, we've got Spooky Aura, Wizard Ward. Brings into being a barrier that protects the user from offensive spells. That could be good. Let's just have a look in here, what we can see. MP, Fire and Earth Resistance. I do agree with what you were saying before, which um, we don't necessarily need another healer. No, I don't think so. So, um... Like that, I shrug. Do you know what I mean? Like, we'll uh, get it if we want to later, but I just sort of think it's not really a um, priority. Hmm. So how about we start at the bottom? We get some of these things, like this one here, a barrier. What Even, were those? So there were some at the top there, sorry. Yeah, yeah, that's, um, right, that's right. Which are like, re- protects all party members. So if there's a couple of those, those could be useful to do like fire and stuff, right? All right, let's, let's work our way around this. Hem of air. Hem of thunder. Now I'm going to see what that is. Yeah. Hem of light. Light. Ooh. We don't usually have light-based enemies, right? No, but it makes me wonder, right? Like, what's the coming? Is there a fire-based one? Is that the one that we already have? Down the bottom? Ice. Ice. Fire. Fire, oh, ice. Oh, okay, cool. So, yeah, great. Yeah, thunder, earth, and light. Okay. Well, we've got shit tons of points. Yeah. I reckon, don't worry about the light one right now, but maybe get the earth one, yeah. Okay, now let's pop down. The- Ooh. Hey! Serena. Ballard. Nice. Okay, so I'm going to pop down the bottom. Mm-hmm. I think we should get Spooky Aura. Let's get that. What? Yeah, let's see if we can unlock that question mark in between, because it would be nice if it was a... Uh, something good. Um, like increased damage or something for spears. Be like, be like water. water. It adopts uh, a fluid flow that can greatly increase the number of parries performed and enables the user to counter. Counter? I like counter. I like counter. I'm going to get it. Yeah. I wonder it's if that one but... above will be similar to that, or whether it'll be whips-based. It's whips-based. Oh, it says it's whips. Okay. Well, that's good to know. So there's magical might, which I think is worth getting. Definitely. It's fairly cheap. Yeah. Um... There is MP, which I think is always good as well. Mm-hmm. So let's just get that. Let's see what our... Oh, shit. Yeah, it's Vim. Okay. Enchanting, Enchanting Echo. Echo. Enables the user to occasionally cast the same spells twice at no extra cost. Cool. Whoa, that costs so much to get. Holy so... shit. Gee. 65p. That, that's, that can just sit there. <laughs> Well, I don't need that that badly. <laughs> uh, <laughs> ice and wind resistance. Fire and earth resistance. Sage's breath. I'm curious about what that is. Yeah, same. Which one do you want? Fire and earth? I reckon fire and earth. I feel like we get attacked by fiery enemies more than we do by... It's a pep skill. Channel Anger mm. greatly increases the damage done by offensive spells the user casts. Cool. What's the bottom one? You actually do. Whips up an ethereal wind that gradually restores the user's MP. Ooh, that's actually quite good. I feel good. like that's better than the, the one above. I mean, we can afford both, though. I guess the question is, do we want to save... Now that we've, seeing as we have 34 sitting here, do we want to save up for that double cast ability? Probably. Yeah, let's, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Cool, 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 cool. Um, hey, good work. We should check what she's got equipped. I kind of, I kind of also want to go save now that I've. I can wear nothing. <laughs> Maybe oh. start with auto equip, yeah, and work from there. Oh, that's, that's pretty good. Pretty good. She's got no stuff on though. No accessories. Charm. 
uh, restores a little bit of lost MP. I'm going to put that on for her. Sure. And um, it restores HP. That increases attack power. Nothing. Raises an eyebrow or two. It's just a defense and charm. <laughs> uh, boost defense by a little bit. Attack. Uh, It'll be interesting to see how much damage she's doing. Um, so I think I'm going to pop on just one that does gives her a little bit of HP. Why not? Defense. Either that or the strength ring might be good. Okay, let's give that a go. Uh, so that cool. means she. Because I don't imagine that her. Um, I don't imagine that her attack is very strong. Seeing as it's not what she was designed for. No. I'm just having a quick look at the other dresses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good call. Uh, okay, now. All right, that'll do for now. Now, Sweet. should we? Okay. The question is, should we go save? <sighs> no. Carry okay. on. Moving on. <laughs> Take the risk. I only say that because I, I don't think we're in a particularly dangerous area. Ah, there you are. So glad you could finally join us. Don't assess us. Idrisil blessed me with another vision in the night. I saw Veronica standing upon this very ledge. It is known as Luminary's Landing. When Erdwin descended from the heavens after facing the Dark One, this is where he alighted. And this is the Calamus Flute. In my dream, Veronica played upon it. It once belonged to the great sage Serenica. She left it in Arborea on her final visit, the day after the Dark One finally fell. I gave it to Veronica as a memento of her heroic ancestor. And yet, when I awoke this morning, there it was, upon my pillow. It is a sign. The flute will reveal the path you must tread. Serena, my child, if you would be so kind. Of course. Because apparently if you know how to play one instrument, you know how to play... All of them. All of them. I think I must be doing it wrong. Oh my gosh, let Nudel do it. But if Veronica was playing it in Father Benedictus's vision, it must be the key. Can you Please let Nudel do perhaps? it. <laughs> I just want him to be like <laughs> or nothing. Just like, <laughs> it's yeah. <laughs> it's glowing. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> I turned into a dick. What? <laughs> what? Oh, it's a fishing rod. Oh, no. What the? Yeah, thanks, Jade. Yes, yeah, yes. <laughs> a fishing rod? I fear it is I who am seeing visions. Every time I think You've this, got a bite. this is too dumb. Go on, darling. Really it, it does something that really makes me laugh. You know? Yes. No. Oh, he made a sound. Very exciting. Oh, holy shit balls. What? Oh, <laughs> they just mashed a whole bunch of different creature design together, didn't they? Flying <laughs> fish. Oh my no, gosh. that's a whale. It's an angel whale. <laughs> so it was as I suspected. It was upon her back that you rode in my dream. 
the sacred conveyance of the luminary, Cetacea. It seems that she heeds the call of the flute. You must play it whenever you require her aid. Why is it a flute if it's not actually a flute? Wow. Nudel acquires Nudel. the Calamus flute. Calamus flute? Which is, which is not a Go, flute. Luminary, it's actually a fishing rod. And seek out the floating island. It is the world tree's will. Whatever awaits you there will surely aid you in the fight against the Lord of Shadows. Do not let Veronica's sacrifice be in vain. Now, play. Oh. <laughs> Why did we get actual music before with Serena? I had nothing oh. now. Oh, that's just weird. I was like, I was waiting for it to be a joke. Like, wow. Ha -ha. <sighs> <sighs> We're getting some strong Final Fantasy X flashbacks right now. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is weird. This is very weird. Why are there like five sets of wings? They don't make noises through their mouths. Like, I'm a whale. Wah! They don't <laughs> make noise. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Is that? What the shit? The loveliest catch awarded for recovering the flute left behind, behind by the late Veronica and with it summoning the serene being known as, known as Cetacea. Well, no, we no, 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 no. Oh, oh, now we can oh, oh. fly? Okay, so what it's kind of strange because I don't have any... She just goes, right? I can only speed up and direct. I can't stop it. I mean, like, I can't just, oh. like, hover. Right. Yes, yes. Oh, what's that? Sparkly. Yeah. Something sparkly. Go for the sparkly. For the sparkly. What does it mean? Land at the Champs Sauvage. I don't really want to. Railway no. station. Are there other stations? Can we have a look? Oh, okay. There's like a fucking fortress of death. Yeah, let's not do that right yeah. now. That sounds also, like the, a the planet. The freaky orb! Oh, okay. We've got to save it. We've got to find somewhere to save it. Well, let's it? go to then... Shop Sauvage, though, since that yeah, is the yeah, place yeah, yeah, that yeah. And then... we can get off. Yeah, I think so. It's a whale way. My gosh. It's interesting. I know I keep talking about Dragon Quest Eight and, like, the comparisons between them. But it was a similar thing where, like, kind of semi-late game, you suddenly got the ability to fly, and it was such a, like, it was kind of, like... That's what these unnecess are. Unnecessary? Uh, like, it was, like, like in the sense that, like, you could kind of get to everywhere that you really wanted to go. Um, we have fast travel. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so interesting. So these these platforms are the whale stations. The whale way. Okay. I think that's very funny, and you're not even commenting on it. Railway. Yeah. Nah. Like railway. Uh. It's a joke. <laughs> yeah, nah. I didn't pick up on that. <laughs> railway. <laughs> oh dearie me. Okay. Okay. Now, where the fuck are we, and how far do we have to go to get to a fucking save point? Aha! Oh, a little friend did us good. Uh, we have a recipe book entitled "An Earring for Every Element." We take a look inside. We learn how to make cinder block earrings, all weather earrings, blackout earrings. Oh, maybe we can fast travel to a save point. We can't. Well, maybe, but I just want to have a look. Like, where the fuck are we? Down here, because I thought I saw. A Yeah, this. Ooh! Can you get in? Is that one of the ones we can open? Locked tight. Obviously not. No. Oh, okay, I just wondered if we Boo. might be able to. Mm -mm -mm. Right, because it's the red doors that we can open, but it's not the... Hey, Sim bunnies. Either. Um, can we can you get out of here? Can you map me and just give us a sense of where the fuck we are? Or are we going to get... 
<laughs> oh, these guys are these guys are very uh, Dragon Ball Z-A. Eh? Yes. This stuff. Is cool. Ooh, we got a new. Uh... Look at this fancy thing. <laughs> Mm, 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 mm. Ah! So, Jade. Cut him in half, Jade. <laughs> cool. I, I do love how these... Oh, the other guy's, like, on the ground. Oh, yeah. He's not actually dead. That's kind of unsettling, isn't it? Yeah, it's, uh, the wiggly feet, they're, they're problematic. We're ah, still, still wiggling. He's still there. <laughs> he's, he's quite speedy, isn't he? Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it either. Okay. At least he's gone now. He's gone to wherever all good monsters go. Alright, so you wanted me to show you the map. That's what we were doing when we were running away. Uh-huh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm just going to get up out of the way. Mm. Okay, cool, 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 cool. And then we're going to do the map. Right, so we are in an inaccessible place. Right, that's interesting. So I guess the, the point is you just can sit down and then get fast the travel? Fast travel. Ah. Okay. <laughs> I do this every time. Like it's one of the buttons. Okay. Interesting. Shit. Well, I picked okay. one of them. You sure Whatever did. that was. Great job. We're going to a campsite. Cool. Cool, Lou. Here's my cat. She's gone. Buddy? What I might just quickly do oh, with us. is um I'm just seeing where we are. Summit Shrine, that's fine. I'm gonna party talk, people. Did you want to talk to me? So Serena says, Oh, isn't it wonderful, Nudel? Flying through the sky on Cetacea's back and seeing all the places we've been from way up high. Now I wonder whether floating island Father Benedictus told us might be oh we're going to the floating island. Time to stop looking down and start looking around. Okie dokie. Oh. oh, my little baby. She got in a fight with my mum's cats. Oh no, they're out at the same time. Yeah, mum had said that she had locked the cat flap, but she had actually just left it open. Whoops. And, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that was a whole thing. That sucks. So now we have to... Okay, now we have to go back to the... The... Oh, shit. How do we get back on the whale? Y yeah. Because it was... It was... I just assumed we'd get a flight point to there. Yeah. It was the Champs Sauvage. But there and was... it was... The, the whale spot there. Yeah. I thought we would get a spot as well, but... What if we go back to Arborea? Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we'll just be able to walk up the hill. Right. Right? Yes. Right. All right. That's weird that we didn't get a flight point for that. Like, I suppose they didn't expect you to just, like, fuck off. Well, surely that's the point of them, right? They're like, okay. you're not going to get on the whale, immediately leave, and then fast travel somewhere no, else. No, I mean, we should be allowed to. We should be allowed to, yes. Man, these games. What's a great story we can tell while we're going up this up this fucking set of things again? Well, I think I'm going the right way. Yeah. Yeah, you are. Uh, well, I can tell you that. Oh, oh, okay, you go. My cat is very soft and fluffy. She's and wonderful. She's getting a good scratch right now. 
So, so you know, I'm doing my duty as and one of the members of Anthropolikitty. So I've got a good cat story. Um, I can't remember if I told this to you last week or not, but basically, uh, it was in the middle of the night. Inca was sleeping by my shoulder. Mm-hmm. And um, oh, hey, we got music. Nice. Hey, he can. He somehow learnt to play the flute. That was actually okay. a nice piece of it. So we're looking for a floating island. Oh, there it is. Love how it like, points is. us in the direction of it, and I'm like, go <laughs> anywhere else. Anywhere but there. Um, Inga just sits up in the middle of the night and starts growling at the ear next to the bed. Oh, oh, ghost. Yeah, ghost. And, and my brain's like, ghost? Or because she's um, the battleground. The battleground? That seems <sighs> ominous. Maybe this is not the right floating island? Well, it's our floating I can't remember why they want us to go to this floating island. Hey guys, I hope you know that we're real good at playing video games. Yeah, this mysterious object looks almost like some kind of giant candlestick. My cat has just very recently learned that... Uh, Can I light it on fire somehow? Computer screens have things that move in interesting ways. So what happens when you go up to the purple? Presumably you can't go through it. Oh, sorry. It says... Uh, A foreboding sense of something. Foreboding fog hangs over the entire area. It doesn't seem like a good idea to proceed any further. Uh, I assume, but like, I can't use the other characters, can I, in the world to like do fire? Ah, no, you can't. Um, I reckon this will be the wrong floating island. I think they wanted us to go to the island that the tree used to be on. Uh, well, that's alright. We're having a look at these floating islands, and this is interesting. Yeah. One called Battlefield. So. Uh, Inca stood up in the middle of the night, growled at the air. I, of course, could turn on the light, because the fuck, right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> um, and then I'm like, oh no, spirits. <laughs> and then, yeah. And then yeah. I'm like, no, no, she's 16, nearly 17. She's just senile, right? Yeah, yeah, she just had like uh, a nightmare or something. Yeah, and then that's fine. So I turn off the light, and then moments later, she's like, growls at the air again. And I was like, oh, I can't be fucking doing this. <laughs> um, growls at the air again and then just stands there <laughs> in silence staring at it the air oh. and so I um, turn the light on give her some pads uh -huh. and uh -huh. in that moment I was like spirits or oh, she's going to see now and in that moment I chose to believe she was going to see now <laughs> <laughs> this is the best possible wow okay this is like little Mario house up here yeah. not Mario um What's that thing in Dragon Ball Z where, like, oh. when he dies, he goes to the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Oh. Weird object behind you. Cute. This is weird. The face is not good. I'm not happy about that. No, no, I like it. So there really <laughs> is an island in the sky, just as Father Benedictus said. I wonder if he was right about there being something helpful here, too. Well, it's a much Something. better island than Battle Island. Is that a temple of some sort? <laughs> yeah, just Battle Island. Well, there must be some reason we were brought here. Shall we go and find out what it is? Udell, of course. Though, though the centre of this uh, group is not allowed to voice an opinion about... Anything. Anything. This is cool. I'm yes. just having a look around. Thank you. Thank you. Um, it's what I wanted you to do. You read my mind. It's almost like we've been playing video games together for like a million fucking years. A million years, yeah. Uh, is that treasure? No. It's like a log. Stump. A log. Interesting. All right. I have lower, lower depth. Hey, 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 hey. It does. Oh, the weird face. Colourful cocoon. Colourful cocoon. Yup. Alright. Okay. Let's do this. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Oh, it's got a smiley face on the door. Yeah, I didn't notice that. <laughs> Don't like it? Don't like <laughs> it. <laughs> you like the faces. The faces are everywhere. Hmm. We can see you, you know. Come out from behind there. Oh my gosh, you're totally oh. right. Mm -hmm. no, what is it? That's rude, Eric. It's <laughs> <laughs> uh, you! I'm off the watchers. 
The Watchers? And what are they? Of course. Ground dwellers not know. Not know of us. We watch over Erdria. Watch for as long as Erdria exists. Well, what do you know? And what are you doing skulking behind a pillar, Mr. Watcher? This is home. Home of all of us. Once were many islands. Many watchers. But attack came. Lord of Shadows. All crashed. Only this island remains. Only me. That's awful. Uh... Mortigan got to you guys too, huh? Sounds like you've been through a lot. Sorry if I was out of line just now. How come you survived <laughs> anyway? And why did this place get left alone? Guiding light burns within. Has burned since time began. I really One feel like... Oh, dawn. sorry. Here yeah. was cleaning. Attack came was protected by guiding light. I really feel like the voice I've chosen for this just doesn't work at all. Like, it's all capitals. Like, it is like like a robot. Yeah. But it's, it's like a weird little kid voice. Yeah. But mm. strange. This guiding light of yours sounds pretty special. Oh, we're here looking for a special something to help us defeat the Lord of Shadows. Do you think the guiding light might be it? Thanks, Serena. Hmm. Hmm. Not known. Is not weapon. Cannot defeat. Perhaps. Wish to help. But am only a child. No elixir oh. of the world yet. Oh, that makes sense. Guess we'll just have to take a look for ourselves then, huh? I like how you like, they sound like a kid, and it's like, I am a child. It's like, oh, thank yeah. goodness. Thank okay. goodness this yeah. is, like, explained. Yeah, yeah. Yes. But what are we going to do about our poor little friend here? I mean, they're not our responsibility. Not I'm fine. I'm Watcher. Story of Watcher's not over. You beat Lord of Shadows. Then World Tree returns. Cycle restored. Life and rebirth. Dead ones get new life. My brothers, my sisters, all begins again. Please this be creepy Mary, face. Succeed. The like permanent smile at the end of every sentence. Succeed. Smile. It's really bothering me. Wait. You know who he is? Hmm. Hmm. Uh. <laughs> right. Been here, been here since beginning. My people, watchers, watching, protecting. Play. You know what? It's creepy. It is creepy. So okay. So this so one thing I want to say about this is that so clearly very similar to the design for what's his name Kai <laughs> in Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball Z right? right? Mm. Who is based off a. Uh, Right. Oh, new. Also, Which is not a racist a, design. I know I was going to say, and the word, I think, as well. People don't. Anyway. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Apologize. I didn't realize that was like a censored word. Um, yeah. So it's like, like, they've obviously made this character not have, like, black skin and red lips and white cheeks and weird eyes and stuff because they're like oh we've been told off for doing that kind of design because it's super racist but we're going to keep the character anyway we're going to keep all the other design just kind of change the colour palette and somehow it's like it's more creepy but not like I'm not saying it's worse than a racist stereotype it's obviously not worse well no it's like it's, like, it's just as bad because it is like you're, you're like because it's keeping the core of it yeah! So it actually holds on to its terrible roots. Yeah, the kind of weird over, like, pouty lips thing, and, and like... The caricature. Uh, eyebrows, and... Yeah, yeah. 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 The whole thing makes me feel weird. 
Seek flame and temple, learn more. Learn of power to banish darkness, perhaps. Smile. Okay, cool. Hey, look, there's interesting things on the mini-map in there. Ooh, let's have a look. Plant shapes or something. Ooh, ooh! Hey, it's like the thing that's floating around outside. Hey. Kind of. All right, well, I'm going to avoid the center for a second. Uh-huh. And go touch this. A mysterious uh, energy mm-hmm. emanates from the seedling. It feels similar to the energy given off by Yggdrasil's roots, but nothing happens when you touch it. Oh, it's, it's a seedling! A it's yeah. a baby wild tree! Okay, lovely. And there's three of them. Same, same thing. Nothing okay. happens when you touch it. I just want to make sure. Sure, sure, sure. And then I'll touch the light. Oh, yes, I've like... Over the years, I've managed to, touch it. to like imbue you with thoroughness. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I feel more of a responsibility because you're not here with me to like prod me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To be like, stop it. Oh, it's beautiful and so holy. I feel purer just looking at it. Wait, the mark. Cool. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Is this a good thing or a bad thing? Whoa, did all that light just get squished down into that little thing? I guess that kid doesn't have any protection anymore. Hmm. Nudel acquires the guiding light. Hmm? Oh, look! <gasps> I Why would there be three? very special in them. I know this feeling. Yggdrasil. I think you should take a closer look, don't you? I have a feeling they have something rather important to show us. No, Serena, we'll just leave this room with the glowing Yggdrasil seedlings and just be like, well, nothing to see. Isn't it amazing? Oh, hang on. So you all saw that too, right? Yes. That man. The mark on his hand. Oh. You don't think... <gasps> yes, I do think. Uh, aye, I do. And I have a feeling you've the same instinct, laddie, eh? That was Erdwin, the luminary of legend. I never thought I'd see him with my own eyes. So those were the original heroes? The ones who defeated the Dark One way back when? The more we know about them, the more chance we have of finding out how they beat him, right? Ah, you're not wrong. Let's see what those other seedlings have to show us, shall we? Okay. Uh, what I was going to say before is the amount of times that Nudel's hand glows and he doesn't seem to notice until someone else points yeah, it yeah, out yeah. is alarming. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, and we're, like, also, like, I was just thinking during that sequence that, like, it seems like the entire point of Nudel's character, like, it, in the context of this world, is just to kind of have as little personality as possible so that he can just be, like... It's like he's a hammer. He's the luminary hammer. And, like, other people get to pick him up and, like, smack <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh... Okay, we've 
we've been to that city, right? Hmm. It's Galopolis, right? Yeah. And so there's people who look kind of like people in our party. Like yeah. one of them looks like Jade. Did you see the size of that hammer? Was it just me or did it seem special somehow? I mean, I'm sure you think it's special. No weapon, that much is certain. A forging hammer, if I'm not mistaken. But what were they forging? I wonder. Well, I think we all know where they were at least, don't we? Let's see if the last seedling makes things any clearer. Okay. Volcano. All right. So smashing something in a volcano. Ah. Forging something. Is the one ring. You? I'm sure of it. <laughs> so if I understand what we saw correctly, they found some ore and a hammer, then went up a mountain and forged a sword. <gasps> Wait, of course. The sword of light. Indeed. They would not have gone into battle with a dark one unarmed. Of Why course. did nobody think of this earlier? Of course, of course. The sword that everybody knows about. Of yeah, course. Everyone knows about the sword. Uh, uh. Yes, that's the power we need. That's how we'll drive the darkness from the world. But Mordigan took it, right? Unless... Are these visions trying to say we need to... Yeah. Forge a new one? That must be it. We need to make our own sword of light, just like the old heroes did. <laughs> All right, we've got ourselves a plan. Not much of a plan, but we'll just have to fill in the gaps as we go. Let's start by paying a visit to the places we saw in those visions. I'm betting we'll find some more clues there. Aye, it looked like they found that ore and another one of these floating islands. I reckon we'll need to have a word with our wee pal about that. And that was Galopolis in the vision where they had the hammer, right? Maybe the Sultan knows something. <gasps> oh, and I remember now. That mountain, it's the volcano near Hotto, isn't it? Mm. How could I forget? Oh, I'd completely forgotten about that. Oh, sounds like we're going on a wee world tour then. Hotto, Galopolis and... Uh, Whatever that other island happens to be. It seems we're setting off on another adventure, Veronica. You'll be with us in spirit. I know it. All right, let's go to work. <clears throat> Aw, that felt like a nice moment. It did, and that's a nice moment to leave it. We'll mm. find something to save, though. Mm. See if our little friend has something to say to us on the way oh, out. Uh. You find blueberry? Thing you seek? Smile. Mm. I'm taking your fucking magic light! Nudel explains everything he and his companion saw. Hmm. Always intriguing. Remember a tale from my grandfather. Oh, we've been there. Battleground? Why would anyone go looking for ore on a battleground? We've got fire now, is it? Mm. Mine was there. Mine of great ores. Oh. Great powers fought for ores. I thought... Great battle occurred. Oh. Great losses. Great pain. Victors took all. 
You thought what now? I thought he was like mine, as in it, it was mine. Oh yeah, mine like, was um, there. Like me and mine, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Tale of centuries ago. Perhaps tale false. Perhaps all remain. Perhaps. Well, it can't hurt to go into the look now, can it? Come on, you lot. Kill the purpose. If you need clues, come to me. Tales from Grandfather may help. Uh, Good luck. Don't like it as a. Nudala remembers some places that he's visited. He can now use Zoom to travel to Hotto and Galopolis. Uh, oh, right, because they were back on the other place that we bailed from right yeah so I'm just actually I'm gonna because it said we can zoom I'm gonna do oh, that right. and I'm gonna zoom Good to like a call. campsite yeah yeah and safe be cool hey the Emerald Coast is one of our favoured <laughs> zoom sites I think it's because it's like first on the map <laughs> yeah 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 oh man that was quite a little plot that was interesting yeah we got a whale we got a whale uh, yeah, cool. fucking weird. It was a strange time. Talk to a creepy a alien creepy child. Thing. Yeah. Um, yeah, and now we have the next section of the game to go on. It's interesting because it's... <sighs> The game keeps being like, and now there's another chapter. You've got kind of like, you've got stuff to do because mm. of it. Mm. Uh, but it doesn't have a good sense of. What, what am I trying to say? You know how like in games you have a sense of like how much how close you are to the end. Yes. This game does not feel much like that. It's just like, oh, okay, we thought we were almost finished, and now there's more. And then we thought we were almost finished again, but now there's more. That's. That, yes, you're 100% correct. Like, I keep feeling like we're at the end. And then there's another yeah. chapter. And now, yeah. like, I thought we were at the end again, even though I knew, mm. like, time-wise we weren't. Um, but then it's like, now have a whale. <laughs> and visit all these and places. And a new, new set of quests. You've a got new to set of forge quests. a magic yeah. sword. Yeah. So, um... I don't know how I feel about it, but there you go. But if you think about time-wise, that probably forging the sword... We'll gather all the bits, we'll do that, and then it will be the lead up, right? We'll maybe fight some generals on the way or something. No, who knows? I don't know. Somebody said to us when we started the kind of like ne apocalypse world, they were like, now, now the game really begins. Fuck. Which. It's just depressing. What does that even mean? <laughs> In terms of how much time there is. And we looked up our time, eh? Because mm -hmm. we were like, somebody, I think, like, like average completion is like 85 hours or something like that and we're up to 70 something but of course it's all fucked our time is fucked because sometimes we leave the game going and when we have while dinner we like, while we have dinner and stuff so yeah. um, who fucking knows who, who knows, knows? also <laughs> but we did look up chapter wise and chapter wise we were kind of on track did we? or did we do that for Nino Kuni? oh fuck I'm pretty sure we just did that for Nino Kuni you're right but anyway, this game's much better than that, so we're probably going to finish it much sooner. I'm yeah. having fun. I am having I like fun this too. Game. Yeah. As I say, every time I th I'm like rolling my eyes at how twee it is, then it comes along and does something slightly more interesting, and you're like, oh, I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Yeah. Good I'm having fun. Uh, mm. It is a good game. I'm enjoying it. As much as, you know, we make fun of it, I think that's part of the fun. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Anyway, friends. Weird is... shadow just passing over us. Is it the whale? It's just the... No, it was oh, like it's just... a tree. It's weird. Uh, friends, it's late, and we are going to yeah, go... Yeah, I'm going to go to bed. Yeah. Um, but, hey, we've recorded it, despite... Why aren't we doing this in the same place? Oh, because you're sick. Yeah. And coronavirus. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but, you know, hopefully this didn't fuck out, and... Uh, will prove to be a way of us recording if 
one of or both of us are sick in the future. Yeah, uh, just to be clear, basically at the moment, like when we're recording this, there has been like not even any cases confirmed in New Zealand, just a case that passed through New Zealand. Yes. For two days. Um, and so they're saying that anyone who has cold or flu symptoms, even if you've been nowhere near the places, uh, you should stay home. And that's it. Yeah. And I was growling at Isabella because she was thinking about going to her hairdresser tomorrow. Yeah. Like, you're sick! Yeah. She's got a cold. And I was like, they haven't been to the places, and you were right, Fully were like, doesn't matter! <laughs> <laughs> so, um, <sighs> anyway, you're right. And friends, you should do the same. Yes. Uh, and thank you for joining us. Yeah. And we'll catch you next time. See you then. Bye.